We got Moxie from a rescue, golden rescue group um, when she was about six months old and a year later she developed mega esophagus. And so we um, spent quite a few months trying to establish a routine where she could thrive. And this is what we came up with. First of all, um, my husband built a little box for her. It's called a Bailey box. We found it on the internet and they described how to build it there and we just kind of winged it. We built her this box, lined it with cushions uh, from lawn chairs and pillows on the bottom and then made these bumpers out of pool, um, pool noodles. And then we had to teach her how to get in it. And that was probably the biggest problem. And eventually we did find a um, dog trainer who helped us in one hour session teach her how to back into this box. And you will see now that Moxie loves her box. Okay, come here. In your box. In your box. There you go. There you go. Good girl. Pause up. That's it. So, now this is how she has to be fed and she stays in this box for 20 minutes. And we feed her twice a day. At first we started out with four small feedings, went to three, and now we're down to two sort of regular sized feedings. I make her food, but I also give her a treat, which is a banana or some egg or something that she used to love that she doesn't get anymore. And uh, so she gets that. And then I make her food out of um, her regular dry dog food, which I wet and I mash up and then I add a can of um, wet dog food and then I make it into these little meatballs and then I kind of drop it down her throat. This seems to propel the food into her stomach and as long as she stays up for a little while after she's eaten, she has very few problems anymore with vomiting. Sometimes she still has an occasional episode that lets us know that this has not gone away but our feeding technique is usually um, working for her. She seems to be thriving. She plays ball, she plays frisbee, she goes on long hikes, and she seems to have a happy life apart from these 20 minutes she has to spend in a box twice a day. So we feel like it's okay. <laughs> it seems to be okay by her. We also have to give her water after her feeding. Um, from a bowl up in the box. If she ever gets water when she's down on all fours, that usually comes back up. Water seems to be the propelling thing. Anyway, there's Moxie in her box. Just show from the front how she's sitting there. And she doesn't mind it at all. In fact, if we forget or doing something else and we come back, the doorbell rings or something, we come back, she's still in her box. Hey, hey,